creatively wise, right? Like y'all in the studio and everything. Like walk everybody through like, you know, what a session's like or getting a song started. Do you guys- You look walk in. Look. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding. Let <laughs> me walk in for me. Probably for me, depending on who you're with the members, right? You mm -hmm. get the members, the certain members that we work for the day. For me. What were we vibing with for the day? Go in the studio, right? Probably have some written the day before or not. Mm. Play the beat. I don't be having that. That's how we used to do it. Yeah, that's how I used to be. So you y'all was starting off writing and shit? Hell yeah. yeah. I used to be writing in the strip club. In the strip club? One of my yes. mother. Yes, yes, bro. So, so talk about writing in the strip club, because that's got to be fucking that's distracting. I don't feel like I'd be able to write. Oh my God. That's a great story. He used to write every day. He was in Miami one time. I'm up, seen, I'm like, he was listening to a beat and writing in the strip club. I'm like, yo, what the fuck are you doing right now? Yo, 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 it's your boy Hakeem, and you are watching Our Generation Music. And today, man, I got a very special, very special interview for y'all. 41, man. Yeah, y'all saw it. What's up, man? What's k looking at? It's like five of them. It's like five, man. You right there? Yup. Shade out. And we got my boy D Bills in the building, too. What's up, man? DD in the cut like a band aid. Like a band aid. Like peroxide. Like peroxide? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, that, yo, you guys. Like Bengade. Bengade? You use Bengade on coffee? Oh, yeah, you use Bengade. Bengade. I've never heard of Bengade. Like alcohol. What? What's Bengade? I don't know what Bengade is, too. Keep it above me. Did you just make that up? I heard of Bengade. Y'all don't know what Bengade is? You, don't, you know what Bengade is? Nah, no, I'm not. you know what Bengade is? Like you Bengade? <laughs> Wait, Isn't that like a medicine? It's a drug. It's ointment? It's a medicine. Yeah, it's like an ointment. Oh, yeah. He said it's that's like Bengay. you being gay. Nah, yeah, that's what it's, that's what it do sound like. Are <laughs> oh, you being gay? Being gay. <laughs> get that later. Oh, man. Yo. Oh, no. oh, man. So it's an ointment, but speaking oh, of lingo, man, you guys, you know, are always dropping some of the flyest shit. You know, being from New York, New York is all about fly lingo. It's a fact. Um, what do you feel like is like a lingo that needs to be retired? Ooh, that's mm. a good question. Uh, it's stupid now. Yeah. Thot. Thot. Yo, thot is no, but thot and tutti is two different things. Well, how do you explain D the difference B. between a thot and a tutti? I think there's so many words for thot. I don't even know how you say thot. Thot needs to be retired, bro. Thot's for me, it's yeah, thot gotta be retired. But thot and tutti is way two different things. Mm. But which one's better? Tutti. Tutti's better than a thot? Tutti's a bobby, pretty. Girl, that respects herself. Baddie. Baddie. Bobby, baddie. Mm. Has very much self respect for herself. Damn. Beautiful you queen. Not. Beautiful queens. Beautiful queens. Yeah. Still a little thotty though? No, no, no. 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 None, none at all. She's a little toothy ish. Toothy ish. Okay. Toothy ish. Toothy -ish. Like three, four bodies? Two. Ten. It's like a Spanish thing. Two. It don't the bodies don't got for me that don't got nothing to do with it. No matter how we grown, baby. <laughs> you don't nah. care about bodies? Nah, for me, not the pet. You can't be no wife. If you're not, not big, nah, not that, not girl. I only, I only care about my, bodies if I'm trying to wait for yeah, my yeah, body. That's I'm a fact. To you. If we on some regular shit, oh, we, we grown. What the fuck? A kill is a kill. Exactly. Bro. What the fuck? I gotta worry about money. I'm not ever calling. For me, we not on that. Sure. Oh, God. Nah, that's just facts, though. Kill is a kill. Niggas, that's... niggas be blind hurt. They're insecure, bro. Tender heart. Not all that. Niggas be tender dick. We not on that. The fool's not all that. bro. Yo, has there ever been a moment with you guys like um, where it's like um, there was like, you know, you're at your show and then there's like you guys all notice one girl and then you guys all like fight over one girl? Oh, no, no, no. Never no. a fight. Never a fight. Yeah, my fight is crazy. Oh, yeah. uh, like, nah, I seen her first in the crowd. Don't matter. Nah, it's laughter. We shit. They pick and choose, bro. Uh -huh. Nobody gonna go on to it for me. We take turns. Okay. Nah, nah, nah. Right touch. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, niggas is horses. Oh, man. You got to make a system. You got to hit the Rochambeau, like, all three. Yeah, horses. Fuck, you got the same game. What? Wait, what? Nah, nah. Yo, bro, you got to relax. Oh, my God. Yo, this nigga is hilarious, bro. This nigga K.R., bro. K.R. got a bad reputation, but you know we're not even going to say that, bro. He got a reputation of doing some crazy shit. Oh, He's trying, bro. bro. He's oh, trying. Let me see. Well, I chilled out. We're a boat. We all chilled out. Yeah, bro. You mm -hmm. said what? We all chilled out. We all happy right now. That's mm -hmm. good. You should be happy. You guys just had your gold single, man. Gold for me, we went gold. Mm -hmm. Ben, gold, hottest gold. song in New York. I felt like hottest I had a song in the world. To this day. 
definitely one of the hottest songs in the world for sure. Um, I feel like last time I went to New York was like in December, and I feel like that's all I was hearing. Like as soon as it came on in a party. You like sure. New York? I'm from Jersey. You from Jersey? Yeah, I'm from what Jersey. Part? part of Jersey? Uh, Boone, New Jersey. Oh, how? Nobody know where that is. Yeah, that's true. Say Boodle? Booten. That's a West Bubble folk. Literally. Call it West Booten. <laughs> so, which one you like better, LA or New York? I love LA. I like LA too. I love LA too. Bro. It's like all the rappers die here, bro. I have, I have thing, a love hate relationship with LA. It's like, bro, I'll love, I'll like be like, one to like some of my LA trips, I really wanted to go home, then like some of my LA trips, but my past like three LA trips were very good. And I've been vibing. What do you feel like changed about the past like three LA trips? Probably just like we'll be we'll be been around seeing more shit. Just yeah. living life a little bit more. They finally starting to treat us like celebrities and shit. Yeah. Like, it had different before we was really grinding. We start grinding but now we got more shit. Yeah. So it had different. Yeah, a little bit more shit. We we still got way more to go though, feel me? Yeah. But feel me? We still got way, 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 a long way, way to go. Bro. You just started. But feel me? But like, just seeing like, for me, experiencing like the new shits, like for me, going to the different level, levels of the shit is definitely a blessing, bro. Like, just watching how like everything play out. Yeah. And, and one of the biggest moments where I seen was um, obviously Travis Scott yeah. bringing you guys in New York. Yeah, you got Station, shot. like that was a crazy stamp. Like yeah, shout out MSG. Travis. What was that like? What was it like coming yeah, out? That's probably on one that of tour? my best shows. That was the best show. That was the best show ever. The ground was like shaking, bro. Oh, Word? Like shaking, like. It's a few the steps, cars though. Shaking. It's a few steps, though. There's a few. We're going to get into them right in a little bit. We got to talk about this Trav one right now. Yeah, that's the big step. Travis, step. Nah, he really, nah, one of the greatest performers, bro. He was on stage performing the song with us. Shout out his fans friend. love Genuine him. Genuine energy, even Phil Fords. His supporters, Phil his supporters love him so much. Like they support anything he do, any anyone he's with. Like the energy they gave, the same energy they gave Travis, they gave us. That's, That's why I was amazing. That shit is a blessing. Word, definitely, bro. Shout out Travis Scott. What was that like? Y'all first thoughts when you got that call, like? For me, because it was canceled at first. Mm. We were supposed to do it, and then we got the word that it canceled, but then for me, one of our big brothers brought back up, yo, we going to read, they, for me, it's back on. So we went to MSG for me, and then we really did it, and then that shit was dead ass crazy, bro. Jeez. A lot of this stuff is like the same day or day before, that's why I just, I swear to God, it'd be so that hard to take in. It's the day before yeah. the same day. Like, they call us the day before, same day, yeah. and yo, come out. And we just... Before we came day. in, he just all set just brought us out. Yeah, we, we had the interview scheduled and then we got the text like, yo, Offset's about to bring him out. Yo, that was what yeah. Did. I was like, yo, I looked at that text and I'm like, good for them. Like, y'all deserve it, bro. Like, for real. Yeah. I feel like it also now is like a mirroring thing, you know, Offset being, you know, someone from the Migos, one of the biggest rap groups, Watch right? That to ever, ever really exist. Um, and then now you guys being from New York, such a, you know, a big place. Uh, that you know, hip hop is is dominant for so long, and now New York has a rap group that's going crazy. We going to the movie theaters, bro. Straight to the movie theaters. Straight to the movie theaters. <laughs> Straight to the movie. Hold you, bro. It's some whole different shit. Did you guys get any like advice from uh, Offset? Because I feel like he's probably one of the best person you know to give you guys advice. Because no, I ain't gonna group. lie. Offset fake told us some shit. He said, whatever you do, make sure y'all always keep the love strong. Because mm. I see what happened to us. I don't want y'all to be like us. That shit hit different. Definitely. Shout out Osa, because like, we kind of in the same boat. Feel me? With the group shit, so like, for me, like, I him bringing us out from the knowledge of the shit. For me, that shit was, that shit way me, bro. I day used to, for me, watch. Everybody going out for me, so that shit way be for me. Niggas embracing us for me, that shit bad. Like, it's a good feeling, bro. Yeah. I mean, that's why I'm humble everywhere I go, bro. Open is. Yeah, I love that, you know, you guys, once, even before all this, I was telling you guys how, uh, the energy you guys have pulling up, how cool you are. Yeah, that's not a Just, thing, you know, I feel like I'm just hanging with the guys type shit. Y'all not on no crazy shit, which I've experienced all types of crazy shit, and this niggas be coming in here all extra to fuck out. But, I love that, you know, I seen in your academics uh, interview, you guys say, yo, like, we not even with the beef or nothing. We straight, straight to the chicken. Like, that's all we trying to get to. But, uh, Focus I, on the money. The beef stopped the money. All, right. all the beef boys put a target on your game. They could keep all the dish when I'm watching their money decline. Uh -huh. mm. really just, that's that's, really. That really just stumbled off for, like, watching how the other New York rappers go out. For yeah. me, it's There's like, so much money in this world for niggas to be beef and gang. We don't, even got, we don't even gotta be friends, bro. 
We can keep it cordial. Keep it cordial, bro. Everybody get money. We don't gotta eat. Tell me, we don't gotta eat together, but tell me, everybody eat. Oh, we're doing our own shit, bro. Oh, man. I really, I really hope that you know we can get to a point like that, especially like New York, because I feel like that's the one thing that just. Yo, look, look. Imagine if niggas wasn't beefing, bro. Imagine the music that would be be created, bro. Mm -hmm. All the biggest artists, some of them got beef. Like, imagine if everybody just like for me, full of one music would be like insane. Like, I wish yeah. Youngboy and Dirk had a song. That would be crazy. That would I think be so. Fire. I think there's a chance that can happen eventually. I oh, mean, I may, maybe you oh, never know. Shit, look oh. at Jeezy and what's the name? Well, they, they, look at Jeezy and Gucci. Tough. They eventually did something. Maybe it takes a little bit more maturing and getting to that point, but. I think the bag was big, so niggas was like, hold on, Tim. What, oh, we, what we really beefing over right now? Did I miss? <laughs> <laughs> nah, yeah, but for me, we chilling, bro. She fuck, for me, we fuck, we fuck with us. We love who love us, bro. Circle real small, though. Yeah. Circle nah, real small. Real, 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 real small for me. Don't get it confused. We fuck with, we fuck with, it's circle real small. Did bro. you guys have to clip people out the click and shit like that already? What you mean? Yeah. <laughs> the niggas ain't make the cuts. <laughs> like, y'all niggas. Yeah, look, that's always gonna happen for me. Like, everybody go. Was that go. hard for you guys? I ain't gonna front anybody now on the same time as us. I gotta go. If we not on the same page, how the fuck is we supposed to elevate? We just not gonna work. Gangsta, bro. Gangsta. We gotta move as one. We gotta all move on the same time. Loose ends gonna make the boat sick. All that's loose ends gotta be cut. Word. Nigga said that for not. He's been waiting to say that. It's a fact man. though, like, a lot of niggas just be around just because it's like, shit, lit. like, you know, understand, we gotta really tell the difference between what's real and what's fake. Okay, you so. know, assets and liabilities, man. Uh, Shit's real out here. Um, another thing, too. Uh, niggas not even rich yet, man. <laughs> so imagine if he was rich. Shit, yeah, different, bro. All the liabilities gotta go. You know, one of the funny things um, I seen recently was Keith Lee going to New York. I know y'all seen that. Cause y'all told me before y'all was on. Like Keith Lee did bad, bro. <laughs> Cash the boy. Like, what do do it? He had the salmon chopped cheese in New York. That's the oh. first thing he, he went, went to. He went to all the rogue spots, gang. Oh, nah, whoever put, whoever told him to go cheese. to those spots did bad. Salmon Whoa, chopped cheese, like who even gets shit like What's that? Salmon? I've never heard of that in my life. Too. Like niggas from New York don't eat that, gang. A salmon chopped cheese? Nah, what he the got a fish fuck? Shake, he gotta go to the, he went to Manhattan. He did bad by going to Manhattan to get pizza. That's a fish shake. You gotta go to the trenches to get good pizza, good pizza slices. Slices is my shit. I know, but for me, that's some like tourist shit. You gotta go to the trenches to get the real slices. You gotta go to Smurfville, boy. Smurfville? Yes. That's where you gotta go. Smurfville what? got everything. What? That's everything the best grill in the hood. Literally. Smurfville, okay. And it's right in Brownsville, the heart of where we grew up at. Next time I'm in there, where would I go to get, I love Italian food. Where, where's y'all like go to Italian spot? The pizza shop. In the church. Italian pizza, pizza and spaghetti. It's crazy because the spaghetti, the best pizza shop is like, you gotta go to the opposite. You gotta go, you gotta go down the blocks to get the good piece. I'm like, hello, <laughs> dude. Listen, I'm gonna need shout to make a call. Shout out. You gotta go to the ad. You go to the ad with the good yo, pizza, the out, Zeppo. Shout out Lavoya and Rockaway. What a call. When I'm in New York, I'm making a call. 41, I need good Italian. Y'all gonna have to send somebody over there to escort me in. Gotcha. We'll be good. Gotcha. Um, so, one of the things that I think you know, has really helped you guys, you know, propel to the heights in your career, is I feel like you guys are like really representing New York, you know, like from Brownsville, Close, Brownsville, Brownsville, Brooklyn, Brownsville, Brooklyn. <coughs> um, like, I feel like you guys give me authentic New York vibes. Like back when I was in New York, I was seeing everybody in Hellstar, Denim Tears, and you know, Amiri. My son was the first nigga I seen in Hellstar. My son came out with it, bro. You was the first one in New York with Hellstar? I, that was the first nigga I've ever seen in that shit. Where I saw Gabe put me on Players Club. Shout out to Players Club. What up, bro? He seen it. I'm like, yo, what's that flock? He like, yo, some new shit, Hellstar. Then like two months after that shit, three months, I see it. Everybody with like that. Like everybody. Niggas over with Nike text them. I don't house see them. <laughs> but yo, we just, yo, shout out House Dog. We just came back from House Dog. Yeah, shout out to guys right. over there at House Dog. Yo, yo a Star. lot of niggas House Dog be fake. Mad fake. If Speak you have, you. if niggas in hell, if you have House Dog in, in LA, it's fake. He don't sell House Star to uh, nobody in LA. Yeah, you can't get the retail House If Star. you see House Dog in a store in LA, it's fake. 
Oh. You can't. Yeah, all of it is fake. You cannot. He don't sell Hellstar. I mean, and, not all to, of it. Not all of it because you can resell some resell yeah, stuff. Bro. But he said, like he said, he don't sell to no stores in LA. Cool, cool Kicks is one of the people that have like good Hellstar. Yeah, he said he don't they sell it have. to LA, and he said for me in New York, it's mad shit in New York that's fake because like mad factories was being built and shit, yeah. and mad clothes, like mad of the Hellstar is fake. Like all the old shit is fake. You sure you about to open a store in New York too? <laughs> yeah, that shit gonna go crazy. Movie theater, I ain't gonna front. You guys will probably be there for the opening and shit. Sure, of course, you know yeah. Yeah, bro. Definitely yeah. can see that. You guys feel like you guys should probably do a collab with them for the next project. That'd be coming from. Coming from, bro. Don't speak on it yet. <laughs> um, yeah, no, I felt like you guys just representing New York. I felt like when I'm, you know, even listening to your music, just the look, I'm like, okay, this is what New York looks like right now. Like these is what the guys is wearing. This is the type of vibe that New York is bringing. Um, <clears throat> another thing I was gonna say, right? On your guys' song, especially Bent, you know, the beats fire. Shout out MC Verse and Synthetic. Um, your guys' verses, the energy. Um, you guys all brought different things to the table on that song. But I feel like something people don't talk about is your guys' ad libs. <laughs> like that shit is all over. Like, yeah. <laughs> I feel like y'all got some of the hardest ad libs in the game. I ain't gonna front. Ad libs is a very key, essential part to the song. Definitely. A lot of people don't use ad libs, but I feel like ad libs complete the, the song. Definitely complete For a fact, for me. So, like, we all got unique sounds and shit for me. So, we all got unique ad libs. We all try to incorporate them in the song. When you, when, you, when you put it all together, Sounds it's great. a movie theater. It sounds great. Or a bro. I, I, feel like, um, I feel like no one really talks. I'm like, yeah, I'm listening to the show. I'm like, nah, these niggas ad libs is off the chain, man. Creatively wise, right? Like, y'all in the studio and everything. Like, walk everybody through, like, you know, what a session's like or getting a song started. You guys. You look walk in. Like, look. Okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Let me walk in for me. Probably for me, depending on who you're with, the members, right? Mm -hmm. You get the members, the certain members that we work for the day, for me. What we want to work for the day? Go in the studio, right? Probably have some written the day before or not. Mm. You play the beat. Bop I don't be having that. That's how we used to do it. Yeah, that's how I used to so be. So y'all was starting off writing and shit? Hell yeah. yeah. I used to be writing in the strip club. In what? the strip club? One of my yes. mothers. Yes, yeah, yeah. So, so talk God. about writing in the strip club, because that's got to be fucking that's distracting. I don't feel like I'd be able to oh write. Oh, my God. That's story. He used to write every day. He was in Miami one time. I've seen, I'm like, he was listening to see. a beat and writing in the strip club. I'm like, yo, what the fuck are you doing right now? Uh, you just like your I was first place, time man? in Miami. Because, nah, like... When I think of something, I gotta write it down before I forget it. For me, okay, okay. And I was it's on just, I, I was just loving the scenery. I was thinking of mad shit, so I just put it in my notes, expressing my feelings. That's what I do. That's what we all do. You but y'all move past from writing now. Though, so. Now we all got time for that. Now, like, it's really different. Now I really just be living in the moment. I really be enjoying life. I won't be on my phone no more. Mm. Like my phone dies useless to me, games to work for me, but. When we go to the store and shit, we go to the store every single day. So now it's like we just freestyle. We just go in the booth and just for me say whatever comes to the head. Do y'all look for one person to maybe start it or it's all kind of different? It just be natural. It just bro. be the vibe we want to go for me. Whoever wanna go, just go. Got it, got it. Whoever ready, just go. How do you feel like you guys push each other like in the studio, like, you know, to help sharpen each other's pen? We all nice. So I like, just remind each other how nice each other are, bro. Like, Positive like, nah, reassurance. Really, I like nah, that. You really nice, bro. Like, you really like, that nigga, man. Make like, you want to no. do better, bro. Gangsta. Have you ever told one of each other, like, yo, that verse ain't next, man? Oh, oh yeah. definitely. Gangsta. That's good. You gotta be honest, because we all, like, anything we put out is gonna be all it, reflecting it. For me? Now, speaking on strip clubs, and since y'all been to so many, my favorite strip club, and y'all was talking about Miami, Booby Trap. Oh my, my god. That's my favorite strip club. In the world. <laughs> in the no, world. Oh my god. What you know about booby trap? What happens in booby trap? Yeah, it's in booby trap. Oh my god. I guess. Hey, <laughs> 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 so oh my god. That place? We done went to the movie theaters. <laughs> we done through 50 plus of booby trap. 50 plus. Well, I ain't do all that. Bro. Bro. 50 plus, nigga. In a night. Shout out my son Sleepy Hollow, nigga. Bro, bro. bro. shout out my son Sleepy, nigga. That place is. It's like, a, it's like Disney World for a grown nigga. What am I, what am I, mother? Straight vibes. Oh, what a bro. I love Miami. I love Miami. I don't, I don't think nothing be in Miami. Have you guys noticed a place where you guys make your best music yet? Obviously, you know, the first, you know, it'd be, round of music. It'd be everywhere, bro. New York. Nah, we definitely flock everywhere. 
I feel that. It really just be if we make a show that's fire, make a show. We that made our best show. Nobody over us coming soon in LA. Mm. That's a new single dropping? No, that's birthday. It's coming soon. Okay, yeah. When y'all hear that, you're gonna be like, yo, nah, what the fuck? These niggas is also different. <laughs> <laughs> Speak about the new single um coming out, uh, birthday. We got DM coming first. DM? Yeah. Is DM dropping in three days, like three, four days? Okay. Her birthday is another hit, though. Fuck a step that we go to the movies. Dude, I'm on her booty. Okay, but do say now she want to do me. Okay, okay. Like this! Feel it. Birthday's a movie, too, though. I ain't gonna lie. Oh my God. Y'all throw a bet with some shit? Watch when y'all hear birthday. It's your birthday. You gotta get loud! <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, that song is different because it's really a birthday every day. Hey, mm -hmm. speaking on birthday, right? It was Cut just this. my birthday. It was just your birthday. What did you do for your birthday? Um, what did I do for my birthday? Oh, I had a show. I had a show the day before. I took my mom and my grandma, and my little sister. We went to Boston. Mm -hmm. For me, it was a good show. Then we came back the day of. Then we went to dinner. Then we went to the strip club, bro. Like I was just chilling on my birthday, bro. Like, oh. wow. You know, my birthday is in six days. What you got planned for your birthday? You oh, just dude. realized like you were completely forgot. I keep forgetting. We gonna be like that. We gonna be outside. Just know. I should come in quick. Just know. A movie theater, uh, AMC recliner. <laughs> recliner. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> seats. You ever been to the movie theater with yes. the recliner seats? I, I, I got a badass bitch right now, so that's the only thing. You ever been to I pick? I felt that. You ever been to I pick before? Yeah, yeah. Oh, and they serve you the food mm, and the drinks. And you get a blanket. Oh. And a bag. Yo, nah, what the fuck? I'm gonna clip my heart. That's not my split. My split been not. Who split is this? So who, which one, who, who be putting too much grabber in the split? Yo, this clip, yeah. what? Yo, what? what? Nah, he rolls No, 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 I think it's yo. Nah, it's nah, that nah. me. Out I think of all of us, it's that Jen. It's that Jen. I'm all of them. It used to be K.O. It used to be K.O. I changed, bro. I like chased them out of weed now. It used to be K.O. It does, it used to be me. So it's you now, you're the culprit. You know what I just, you know, no, I like the I need that kick. I like. I can't run. have my shit just <laughs> boat. Like, I like the kick. The kick gotta make me like. Well, like, bro, mm. we have voices, but we gotta protect our voice for. No, that's a fact. Go for that's it, a fact. But like, Can't when it's it. floating, I dead like. Yeah, you're tight. <laughs> I can't like. I be hot. That's crazy. You know, I, that should make my. I'm gonna get hot regardless. Too much garlic make my hair hurt. My okay. stomach hurt. Have y'all smoked hot grabber? You know, the Jamaican Ooh, shit? That's all we smoke. Oh, so y'all been, okay. You from New York, man. That's true, that's true. My bad. New York my bad, you right. It's, my bad, you right. Yo, so this is called confession. What's something y'all haven't told one of the other members? Damn, I really gotta think off the top of my head. Cause I really told. Yeah, like, like, it's like, it's like, it's like, like goes, like, it's nothing not, goes by. Like, we live with and each like, other. Yeah, we be oh, around okay. each other, so it's like. like we live in the same, for me, house with each other, so it's like, what is there to really hard? Like, it's no skip. If we take something from somebody's room, and then I'm like, I do oh, I gotta tell you so. <laughs> <laughs> now, why niggas gotta tell me something? <laughs> <laughs> like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Like, now, why niggas gotta. Yo. Oh, nah, man. Nah, nah, Remember that later you lost a couple of days ago? Yo, I Damn. I picked, I picked it up. <laughs> I picked it up. <laughs> I pocketed it. Oh, my God. Was, what you was asking for? I, I pocketed it. I helped you look for it. Oh, <laughs> oh bro, that's the worst. Nah, I dead got to tell you <laughs> something. <laughs> Yo, what's I going on? Bro? I dead got to tell you something. Bro. What happened? I was like, nigga, you just got to <laughs> So just confession for Tata, right? Remember when you had asked me for that grab <laughs> Oh, why is it all like smoke materials? I, I knew What's it, wrong with y'all, bro? Like, I knew it was yours, but Jen had told me you had 20 of them. <laughs> so, Not so, 20. So, so, yo. I found you yo. <laughs> I had Wait, no so, grabber. I have no grabber. No, I'm, nah. I'm talking to Kale. Yo, y'all just so, crazy. So after I heard that, I was like, nah, he not gonna care about this one grabber, feel me? But, but I you do care. Me for it. It's the principle, bro. But then you ask me. Yo, can somebody go get my food? Yo, touch <laughs> Yo, me nah. my food. About yeah, my but now I'm explaining what to that? you why I had the grabber. <laughs> nah, that's my confession. You good though, bro? Cause you got the grabber. Yeah, I 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 got the grabber
Cause My confess, food, I'm bro. sorry. <laughs> Gotta confess, man. Nah, that's wacky, though. I was really looking for that shit. <laughs> hey, I definitely think, think I'm think going crazy, bro. Like, hey, bro, bro where the boy? You help this nigga look for the lighter. Nigga, that's even more wacky. That's even more wacky. Yo, you need to sit up. I think you're falling. I'm sick of this shit, bro. Hey, all right, look. So, in the song, Ben, um, you said if the pussy is good, you're going to spend. Church. Um, it ain't tricking if you got it. It ain't tricking if you got it. Um, Real niggas going to make a, a queen feel like a queen, you heard. As you should. Get her in her feminine energy. When well, she it's with me, I treat her like, like a queen. A queen yeah. outside together, her, you got to look like me. I look her good, her baby, so you supposed to look good. So pay attention to the details. We both supposed to shine. We both supposed to glow together. Yes. I want other niggas to look at her. Yeah, that's mine. Oh, mm. y'all niggas want her, but y'all can't have her. Y'all can't. Can't have her. Y'all can't. She's mine. What was going to say? Can y'all describe uh, what a first date would look like from y'all? Studio. Damn, nigga. <laughs> I ain't going to lie. You asked me. You got to put her around some dogs and Damn. put her to the test. Oh, okay. And okay. see if she make it out alive. Well, yeah. Make it out alive. <laughs> thing, bro. You got to put her in a room no. with some dogs. <laughs> nah, nah, nah G, I got to know, know if you a dick rider. Well, look, hold on my eyes. Eyes. Gangster, you gotta put her in the room with Gangster. the dog. If you know, you know. Mm. They still alive because they, to me, they made it through. They made it through the time. They made it through a lot of tests and trials and tribulations. I've <laughs> seen <show> everything. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. It be like that though, for real. You gotta put well, most the of these homes just be one money and dick though. You know how that shit go. Oh like. God, bro. You gotta give them what they want. Not the money part though. It's okay because we love all the hoes. Okay. We love all. We here for we a good time, man. Yeah. Mine love gal, yeah, dude. <laughs> beloved gal, though. beloved gal. What did what did uh, Ninja Man say? Twenty six baby mother. Oh, real bad man. Real bad man. Oh, that nigga is nah, hilarious. We definitely chilling though, bro. We probably talking this crazy shit. Niggas definitely chilling though. I feel that. Celibate king. Liar. <laughs> Liar. <laughs> That's cap. Niggas are Cap. Niggas think I'm lying. Y'all, y'all niggas is young, getting money, the hottest things in New York. Y'all niggas getting to it, man. Stop lying. I'm getting to it. <laughs> Coward, <laughs> he getting to it for sure. Hey, speaking of getting to it, I see you with Meg the Stallion, nigga. How was that? That's my heart. That's your heart? Yeah, that's my bitch, though. I ain't gonna lie. Okay. I, mean, I don't even look at her any type of way. Like, she really got a genuine soul, like, she really care about me. She really fuck with this boy. Like, that's really my miss. Or I feel that. Shout out Megan, man. Shout out Megan, man. Her twerk videos are, you know, <laughs> <laughs> historic. <laughs> historic is not the word. What would you What would you say is the word? Legendary. Movie okay. Theater. Movie theater. Reclining. AMC. AMC. I pick. I pick. Regal. <laughs> um, Blu-ray. That nigga said Ultra. You know about the Blu-ray. He said on Put the that man. Said, oh, that shit. That shit in 8K, nigga. <laughs> I need that shit right now. Um, <laughs> <laughs> hey, um, what was I going to say? Um, Summer Jam's coming up. You guys are booked for Summer Jam. Um, obviously a legendary and a staple moment for New York and New York mm-hmm. artists. You know, what's it like seeing you guys' name on that build and having that coming up? It's going straight to the moon. So I always wanted to go to Summer Jam, bro. Nah, Wait, so y'all never even went? Nah, I've been. I used to see my mom, like my moms always used to go to that shit every year. Like my mm-hmm. pops, all of them, they used to always talk about Summer Jam. They used to have the little shirts. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm talking about, Todd? My mom. The little shirts with Jackson the Summer wanted, Jam bro. logos on My it. mom took me Gangsta. when I was like in eighth grade. Yeah. When I went, that shit was crazy, bro. Gangsta and I, we performed on the stage. I like... When I was in eighth grade, bro, it was crazy. Like, I didn't think I was going to be like a rapper, bro. I didn't think that what, shit was going to be like. What did you think you were going to be? Bro, I don't even know. I thought I was going to be a bull player. Yeah, me too. I was just playing basketball shit. Yeah, you're like, I, I wanted to be a rapper, but I didn't think it was possible. It was really my I was just like, word of bro. Yeah, that's word, word it's always been your dream? Like I love, I always loved music, but like I never thought like, damn, this shit a dead ass be like. Well, we all grew up around like music, like mm-hmm. it was I, music, basketball for me, it was music sports. The music love That's was always there, but was. I just didn't think like it would be like me, bro. And God for me did that, bro. That shit. <laughs> what about right? you? I was lost. <laughs> I'm no, real lost. shit. I, I didn't know what the, what I was gonna do. I was just living. I was just glad to be alive. I didn't know what was gonna happen, but. I didn't know what I was going to be. 
Get your house. Go play. I just knew that I wanted to like be my own boss though. I just didn't know what I was gonna do. Mm. Okay, so. That's amazing. It's amazing to see, you know, where you guys are now and you know where you're gonna take it. Um I'm gonna say, uh I think one of the dope moments too, you know, you guys being from New York is getting the cosigns that you guys are getting. Fabio, French, you know, talk a little bit about that because I'm sure those are guys you guys were just listening to, like, I don't know, like years, oh, yeah. you know, years ago. Oh, yeah. Fabio, Fabio, that's why I'm movie theater, we're a vote. Nah, that's really my brother, right? We're a vote. Yo, it's crazy because I literally just got off the phone with that nigga before we were here. Oh, wow. Literally just got off the phone with that. He is fucking hilarious. I don't know if people know that. Fuck that, that nigga is wild. That fuck nigga is wild. He's also a real ass nigga. Like, fuck all the media shit. He's a genuine oh. ass nigga. Salute to Fabi. It's amazing, man. Shout out Fabi, man. Um, my son was the first, for me, nigga from that town to really, really tap it. I got, I got two more questions. You got a song coming up. Talk a little about the uh, single you got coming up. I got DM coming up with KR and John. Okay, it's bet. Dropping in like three days. Then after that, dropping a Dolly single. Three weeks after that. And then after that, I'm going straight to the movie. Straight to the movie. <laughs> <laughs> straight to the movie. I feel like I can't I can't leave this uh, interview without asking you guys is a uh, rap Mount Rushmore. You don't leave the game hanging. Nah, that's fake crazy. I right, <laughs> <laughs> that was fake crazy. This I. Uh, uh, who would you guys put on your rap Mount Rushmore? Like, like great or who I'm listening to right time, now? All time. All time. Mm. Like New York or everybody. I you know what? Let's do New York. Pop smoke. Definitely pop. Rest mm. in peace for pop. Our generation. For me. Uh, Our generation. Just doesn't matter. Biggie Smalls. Pop smoke. Boogie. Pump Boogie up there, bro. Who else gotta go up there? Jay Z gotta go up there. Hove. Hove definitely gotta go up there. About Nicki. Nicki gotta go Sheesh. up there. Nicki definitely. What the fuck? Oh, that's that's the not crazy. a question. <clears throat> Nicki up there. Bro, I'm going our generation because for me, for me, can't go up the other generation, bro. All right, all right, your generation. Oh, oh our generation? Pop Smoke. One. Uh. Drake. Even I'm from New York. No, <laughs> oh, I'm <Bro>. smack. <laughs> no, this nigga smack. I'm smack. <laughs> All right, pop smoke. Come on, bro. Then, then they gonna have to make like a. A boogie. They gonna have to. A boogie. They gonna have to put all of our faces into like one face, <laughs> and then throw us on there too. Okay. Four one. Yeah. What's this on the town? I don't know why it's not coming. In. Chef or sleep? How about I say that? Chef or sleep, definitely. <sighs> Which one, chef or sleep? Bro, we got, you got, they, it's mad people from the town, one, bro. They ain't one, they ain't one, they one, they one. You put both of them into one, into one. TJ. TJ. Y'all got one more. <laughs> do, do. I'm just playing. Well, I don't know, bro. I can't read it, bro. Like, it's like, it's disrespectful to not say some names for me. I feel that. I respect it. Well, we usually do this to close it out and everything. You guys got me pretty second hand high, so I guess I'm done now. <laughs> I'm just playing. Uh, what we usually do is close it out and everything. What is your guys' message for our generation? Man, we love y'all. Be yourself, follow your own broker, man. Have you want to be yourself? Positive. Chase your passion. Chase your dreams. Stay out the way, bro. Get money. Stay out of trouble. You can do it. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And let us know who else you guys want to see. We appreciate y'all tuning in. Yes, Gang. Sir.